In the heat of a North Carolina summer, 40 soldiers and non-commissioned officers compete in the 2017 Army Reserve Best Warrior Competition. While these warriors will go through the competition relying on their own strength and skill, for Private First Class Scott Smullen, his achievements will be in part to his leadership pushing him to rise above the rest. The old saying, it takes a village to raise a child, comes to mind. You know, everybody from the 325th of my battalion has been great and super supportive, with either, whether it's getting me time on the range, getting me running through sticks lanes, you know, getting me some medical experience, getting me to CLS classes, getting me combative certified, you know, things like that. And that certainly takes a lot of man hours, a lot of time, a lot of effort. And that's why I love competitions like this, because you know, we're all about readiness in the Army Reserves and, and being able to train as much as we do for things like this and being able to participate in things like this and train, it's, it certainly makes you more, more ready to carry out your mission as a soldier. When not competing to be the best, he is a full-time student at the Stevens Institute of Technology and is on the road to receive his bachelor's in civil engineering. While all the competitors are at the top of their game, PFC Smolens feels his willingness to learn and determination is what sets him apart from the pack. When you're coming from the civilian sector, everybody's bringing different things to the table. I feel like it's the exact same thing when you come to a competition like this. You kind of get this convergence of knowledge and this convergence of experience, and it's, it's great to pick up what you can from that and kind of learn from everybody that's around you and have this great team environment where it's, it's everybody against the competition, it feels like, not everybody against one another. Reporting from Fort Bragg, I'm Army Sergeant Fred Brown.